For a record number of adoptions last month, the Dallas Animal Shelter is now facing an overcrowding crisis. And unwanted dogs, they could be euthanized as early as this evening. J.D. Miles is live for us at the shelter now to explain uh, this uh, crisis, this issue they have on their hands. J.D.? Mm -hmm. Yeah, Ken, the crisis is trying to save dogs like King, a beautiful mixed breed who's been here for about a month. The shelter, we're told, is at 106% capacity, which means adoptable dogs like King could face being euthanized to create more space. These are the sad faces of stray or surrendered dogs who have been living in the Dallas Animal Shelter for more than a month. Victoria Grimes is looking for a family pet and thinks she found one here today. Just like a small pet for me and my friend. The dog Victoria chose is lucky because soon the shelter says it will have to euthanize adoptable dogs to create more space. It is really, it's a crisis, and this really is a result of the fact that last month in December was a record intake month for us. The shelter says it took in 60% more dogs in December 2018 than in December 2017. That's despite setting a record for placing unwanted pets. We are getting to the point where we're going to have to make some difficult decisions based on space. We'd want to avoid that. Manager Whitney Hansen says an increase in the number of animal control officers has led to more captures. She's urging the public to consider providing temporary foster homes for dogs until more space opens up. Taking a dog in for a week or two weeks can literally make a huge difference in the number of lives that we can save. And it's a fun way to have a little house guest for a week or two. There are more 500 dogs here right now and only 492 kennels. Uh, King here is a beautiful dog. He's got a lot of love for someone who's willing to give him a chance to show it. Live in Dallas, J.D. Miles, CBS 11 News. J.D., thank you. Pulling at the heartstrings, man. A lot of animal lovers here in North yeah. Texas like to bail them out. Yeah, let's, uh, let's hope that happens.